Hey guys, so this is going to be my Barnes and Noble haul. We went to Barnes and Noble for cookbooks. We got the Ultimate Paleo Cookbook with 900 recipes in it um, because this has such a variety, and um, we figured we got to be able to print something in this one, right? And then we also looked through a whole bunch of other books, and we found the Frugal Paleo Cookbook. I had a list of about eight that I wanted to possibly look at. These two seem to have the best recipes that matched our likes. Um, the pay, ultimate plan, I think, was 30. This one was 20. Um, so that was cool. And then while we were in there, they had 75% uh, off all stuff they had at Christmas time. So I got a rose gold binder or scheduler. It's really pretty on the inside. It's pink. And this way I can log my workouts, my food a little bit better. Also, um, I can put in my YouTube videos that I post, so I make sure I'm getting everything loaded beforehand. Trying to, you know, getting my videos up, I'm just trying to get a little bit more um, on the ball <laughs> with it. Now, one of the other things I got I'll get that there, um, was, because we're going back into foster care, and we don't have a ton of toys, we got this really cute fingerling with a play set, and it was originally 40 bucks, and we got it for 10 so that was a super good deal. I got a couple of mystery boxes I'm going to open here too. And we do have a crib to get an infant. So I got this really cute little Minnie Mouse little hanging toy. And when you pull it, lights up and it plays music. And this was hmm, regular 20 and we got it for 5 we also got this super cute little soft book with like little rings on it. It's just a little soft mini book with like, and this is normally 17, so it would have been, uh, let's see, 340 plus 85, so about, about 425 approximately. Then they had these little five dollar. Um, Little My Little Ponies. We got that one. And we also got this one. Little Pegasus one with a star and a butt. So those have been a little bit over a dollar each. And we'll still pull out these little blind boxes we got. We got a couple. You know, I can't. If I see a blind box on Claire, I should know this girl's gonna buy it, right? Yeah. So. I also got these adorable little sachets um, to put in our in our uh, closet. It's a four pack, and they were six ninety five normally, so that would make these like a dollar seventy five. All right, let's start with these. We got these are actually no, these aren't openables. These are puzzles, hundred piece puzzles. This one is Glenda the Good Witch, and this one is Alice from Alice in Wonderland. And these are regularly priced at $8. So these would have been $2 each. Some math I can do in my head. Now these are the blind ones we got. This one says Tomy on it. And has like little Nintendo stuff on the side. So we decided to see what this was. I'm glad it has a cut on it. It makes life easy. And this says ages 4 and up. I love mystery boxes. They are still my favorite. All right, so I got a keychain. <clears throat> oh, it's so cute! It's a little Nintendo game controller keychain. That's adorable. Nintendo Super something. That's cute. I want like. Play video game. These are little fingerling minis. It's got a little hangy thing for it, I guess. <clears throat> it looks like there's only a few different styles. Hopefully, we can get a duplicate. Oh, this one's so cute. So, we got like a little pink one. And it came in a little ring. That's adorable. I'm thinking this just goes on like a little 
bracelet. And then you got your little finger wing. I don't know if it hangs. Oh, look at that. Hang right off the bracelet. So cute. That's adorable. You got one more fingerling one because they were like normally $2.95. And I was 75 percent off, so that made them like um 30 cents a piece. Hmm. This one has that. Oh, that's Hang on, piece fell out. Okay. So this one has a light pink bracelet and like a blue wave ring we can put on here. And then a really cute little lavender fingerling toy. Really adorable. I'm gonna hang oh look at that. You can hang them off like that. So cute. Oh, you know what? I bet you those are bananas. Because it looks like a monkey. That's super cute. And the last one I had to get was a Christmas Rilakkuma. Because who doesn't love Rilakkuma, y'all? Alright, we're just going to open this up. I'm not, I'm not all about being all. He's so cute. He's a little keychain. And look, it's a little chicken from Rilakkuma. I love it. I have all kinds of these little plushy keychains. One day I'm just going to stick them all in my purse. I'm going to look like a crazy lady. With all these stuffed animals on our purse. But yeah, so that was our haul from Barnes & Noble. I love having a real bookstore because I hate ordering online. I like to have my books right away. I don't like to wait. I didn't have to, so that's great. So hopefully we'll be sharing some of the recipes from the paleo cookbooks we got. Right now we're working on making our grocery list on them and um, see what we can do about getting uh, everything cooked up and recording it and showing you guys some of our great paleo recipes that we found in our books. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.